Hello everyone. Um, this is Yame Kim Sensei. Uh, today I will show you about the smarter syslog. Uh, this is advanced, a kind of <laughs> the messenger based uh, NMS uh, syslog or a kind of remote control system. Uh, when you wake up, you will, you will get a, a message text. The backbone, the SFC is down. Wow. So what will you do? Maybe next step, uh, you will, you will, you need, you will need more information. So you need more information. So what was down? How long? How and uh, what? A, what was service? Was problems? And also you wanna see the check the logs, or you wanna uh, monitor uh, using show command. You can do it if we apply this one. Okay, first one is the real time syslog. So uh, you can get a syslog using Cisco WebEx Teams. Uh, last time I show you so WebEx Teams API using the Amazon. Amazon? What is it? What is it? The, how are you pronunciation about the Amazon? So WebEx Teams bot using API. So so this time it's very simple. Just um, configure the syslog, then syslog will be sent here. Then you can just check the log at real time using messenger. Okay. Second one is show command. So this is an example. So if you clock, if you time show clock, the same the time will be shown. And one of the most common command. So I the type is show IP INTPR show IP interface brief agent menu and it will show you about status. Also, you want to see the logs. So if you just type to show log, log will attach the text file, and you can open. Actually, text file the 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 log file is very large. When you type the show log. It's too large to show at a message, so I handle it as an attachment text part. And but don't type a show tag. Show tag is too large, so you had better do it at the console or your office, not a mobile. So let's see the architecture. It's very simple. The I used a CSR. 1000V CSR 1KV is catalyst actually not a catalyst but it's to use iOS XE and the one machine the host the Python code so you can use a catalyst or Nexus the guest shell or another separate separate the server or VM or container or anything and it uh, it is connected to Webex Teams so Actually, the so Webex teams, uh, they give a hook to the Python, so it must connect it to the public IP or public domain addresses. Anyway, and then on your PC or mobile phone, you can check the log and you can type your command, whatever. Also, for the SSH, I did use Parameter. Okay, it's time to see the code. Code is very simple for syslog, and I did use uh, about the UDP just sample code. Just the port number is 5, for, uh, 514, and you can get a log message using this, just a very, this one simply. And just use your Y2 command. Then, but when you send to this message, the bot has the invited a lot of the rooms so I did use a code to get the room ID so get the room ID it's JSON then each at the each room you can get the room number with you know, like that then the message is sent to each room so okay Okay, I will show you. 
this is victims and uh, this is switch and this screen is the syslog sender the application the python code is running so just simply complete terminal and if i go out so there is a command sent i wish i will show you again okay like that the code is sent and the python code handle it and as you see okay so the log is sent here so i can read it immediately almost real time the second is a little bit complex this is about the webex the webhook and the ssh command using parameter the code is the same with the last one actually last, last time i did show you about how to use webex teams api on the amazon the web sub, amazon server so most most of the things are the same but about the show tag just i sent it's too long sorry and if it's not show log using primico i connect the host then i did use terminal length zero because i want to get the older code then connect then get the result result is uh, it's output it's saved as output but it's not a string so it's a byte or something so using this command it is connect converted to the string then i can send it to the webex teams same as the last time but show log is just different is it sends as a file so so as you know this command so i save as a log that text then it was sent to the client using multi-part encoder so just i copied it from the cisco example then just it text plain and it was sent to sent to me okay very simple oh, this is both the low so here if i do it show ip intbr then parameter sent to the message then you got a result then it sent here okay all right then how about the show log? Show log, the log file will be saved as a text file. Then, oh, it was come here. I can download it to my computer. Then I can open it. Okay, if I open, oh, huge log. Uh, most of things are usually, but anyway. Uh, when you go going to going to work during the in the morning in the bus or in the metro or subway train you can read it you can check it i will show you on the mobile in a teams this is webex teams and the syslog bot is here uh, first you can see the logo is sent here and i will show show clock then the the motion clock is come to me okay and then if i show log the log log file is sent to me as a text file okay log file is here so if i click okay i can see the log actually so during the at the subway metro or bicycle or while driving you can see the log but don't do that while driving okay so just i name it smarter syslog so using webex and using api in the parameter python just we can make it what we need Thank you.
This is Yaman Sensei. Bye bye.